Hello everybody, my name is Gil, CEO of Guardian Optical Technologies. This is how the interior of future cars will look like. Sooner than you think, the car would become our new office and living room. And when that becomes reality, a host of applications and services would come to us users when we commute. But in order for that to really work, there must be a strong interface between the car and us, the passengers. Now, coming back to existing, to present day, all the information regarding us passengers is being gathered by a large number of physical sensors. Let me give you a few examples. So there, are, there is the pressure sensor inside the seat for the seatbelt reminder. There are other more expensive sensors that actually measure our weight for the airbag system, so the airbag deploys according to the mass of ourselves, basically. There are other sensors in the seatbelt mechanism that serve other use cases, again, for the airbags. There are cameras in the dashboard, there are sensors in the steering wheel for driver monitoring purposes to make sure that you and I are looking at the road. Now, all these sensors come with a cost in terms of parts, assembly, and managing a large number of sensor providers. The cost can reach up to $120 per car, and in the automotive industry, that's a lot of money. And unfortunately, that means that advanced safety systems will find themselves only in the premium segment rather than the mass market ones. That's simply not fair. Guardian developed a breakthrough optical sensor mounted on the ceiling of the cabin, scanning the inside of the ceiling uh, of the cabin and providing all the necessary data regarding us passengers, our location, where do we sit, our physical dimensions, weight and height, and even our posture. We can actually outline the contour of the passengers. And here's the secret sauce. Guardian's sensor can detect any motion of any surface inside the cabin down to the one micrometer scale. That's one meter divided by a million. That extreme capability allows us to distinguish between still objects and live people. That's because we have a beating heart, and it creates these micro vibrations that propagate through our clothes, our body, our, our, even the seat that we sit on. And the cost for such sensor? A few tens of dollars. Now, imagine with me, if we save only $20 per car for the car maker, for GM or Toyota, that means cost savings of $200 million every year for each of those. That's quite a lot. Now, for me, <laughs> Now, in other terms, car manufacturers of today understand that they must transform themselves into data-oriented companies. The reason, they want to monetize on us users by providing services and enhancing our user experience. Let me give you a few examples. So, driver recognition. Is it me or my wife driving inside the car? Because I like the seat according to my favorite position. What about my favorite radio stations? How about fleet management? What is the real-time workload of each of the, these Uber autonomous taxis? That's actually data worth money. And in terms of insurance, that's a new way to investigate accidents. So, on one hand, we're cutting costs by eliminating a large number of physical sensors, and on the other hand, we're enabling a myriad of applications today that car makers can monetize on, but many more in the future. And that is why we already started working with five major car companies around the globe from all geographies. But there's one more feature. After 16 years of trying to solve a painful problem, Guardian's technology finally solves the problem of forgotten babies in cars. Our extreme sensitivity enables us to detect the presence of the baby not only on the baby's body, but on the baby's seat and the back seat of the car. It actually means that we can detect presence without a direct line of sight. So, in conclusion, the automotive industry is going through its biggest shift in the last 100 years. 
Car makers understand that in order to win, they must have the richest data possible regarding us passengers that, so they can monetize on us. Now, with regard to cost, think about the impact. If we drive down the costs of these advanced safety systems, they would be available not only from premium cars, but for mass market ones. And that means thousands of lives saved each year. And one of these lives can be yours. Thank you very much.